what's it like being a girl in the media comm department? Whew. Yeah, I mean, we're definitely a minority, but not in a bad way. I mean, it's pretty cool that we're brave enough to break into a male-dominated industry. It's kind of like those penguins, you know, the ones with the crazy hair. I think they're called rock hoppers. Well, yeah, they're, we're like penguins, but we're different. We're, we're cool penguins. I mean, I know there's more guys than girls, and the ratio is a little off, but we're all here for the same reason, and we all want to get the same thing out of this, and... I mean, I'll be honest here. Let's, let's just get to the point. We own the place. Everyone knows we own the place. Out. At the end of the day, uh, what does gender really matter? I don't think we're much different from guys. It's just we get showers and all A's. Mediacom is really difficult. Um, as a designer especially, I think that it's pretty hard. I'm working on Narnia Night right now. I'm doing a lot of work with Ben Greenhoe. Okay, you know, it's, it's okay. Honestly, just tell me what you're thinking. Like, what, what is exactly going on here? It's blue. Yeah. It's blue. Um, I see that. If it weren't for my tweaks, he wouldn't, it would just wouldn't look that good. Why don't you go ahead and leave? You know, you know, <sighs> see you later. So Have a nice night. <sighs> it's gonna be a long night. One of the things that really helps females keep an, an edge over the guys in the media comm department would be our organization. I keep folders and um, like for instance this is my interactive folder. I like to keep um, keep track of when my Dreamweaver books are due or when I when I have to bring in my thumb drive. It's been a lot of fun but I mean it, it's it's hard. Oh hold on. I gotta answer this. This is Professor Bandy. Hey Prof B how you doing? And this is my Espanol folder so that I can practicar my Espanol. I'm, I'm kind of busy right now. Can I call you back? Yeah, yeah, Ben said it's were really good. You did a great job. I wonder why. This is my bathroom scheduling folder for when I need to be in the, the edit suite and I'm wasting too much time in the bathroom because, you know, I would just, I would hate for the difference between an A and an A minus to be me spending too much time in the bathroom and that is, that is not acceptable. Are you kidding me? Who has time for dating in this major? I mean, I worked three jobs, school on top of that, but I did date someone earlier this semester now that I think of it. Um, he was just so sweet and he just really got me and, you know, we just really connected and everything. I, I've never felt that way about someone before. But at the same time, I was taking script to screen and my passion is writing and, you know, my two main characters, their major conflict, it was just inevitable that they had to break up at the end. But I've never broken up with anyone before. And my big philosophy in writing is write what you know. So I had to do what I had to do. You know, I just, I really see us going in two different directions in life. I mean, yeah, we're here now, but I mean, after college, come on, yeah, well, give me a break. Well, well, we can make it work. No, we can, no, we no, can't make no, it work. That's where we just put too much effort into no, it. Okay? No, there's no such thing as too over. much effort. No, I mean, there's I just no really such thing. I wish you would understand what, what I'm just, trying to tell you. It's no, not you, it's I, me. No, 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 no we, we gotta, we no, gotta work this out. No, we can, no, there's no, no wait, working it out. You uh, just don't see it the wait, way no, I do. Uh, I mean, come on, wait, don't go, come on. Cat, did you get all that? Great job. You did fantastic. Thanks. Oh man, we're here now, but I just think that's so brilliant. No, <laughs> it's great. I got an A. I got an A on my script. Ugh, Prof Fanny never gives out A's, and he gave one to me. Oh, and uh, it probably wouldn't have worked out. I'm over it. Would I ever date a media comm major? <laughs> no, no way. Wait, does he know how to do Dreamweaver? Because I'm working on my interactive final website project right now and I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm being completely serious. It would be so great if he knew how to do Dreamweaver. Like seriously, like, do you have his extension? Well, I really want to be a live TV events director. I really just think it's so important to practice and be prepared for anything in the field. 
Um, sometimes, late at night, I break into the TV control room and practice. Okay, ready, cut to camera three. Cut to camera three. All right, go ahead and bring in those graphics. Okay, go ahead and bring in the graphics. All right, let's dissolve the camera one. No, that's a dissolve, not a cut. Okay, it's fine, don't worry about it. All right, let's cut to camera four. Cut to camera four. No, okay, a cut, not a dissolve. All right, we just did a dissolve. Listen, Brian, okay, if you're gonna be my TD, you have to know the difference between basic things like a cut, a dissolve, and a fade. I it is just so frustrating. I mean, I can't even tell you how important it is for people to do their jobs correctly. It just drives me crazy. I mean, even if they aren't real, they still need to do their jobs correctly. Well, I'm graduating in May and I'm looking for radio broadcasting jobs. I'm going to Beijing in August for the Olympics. I'm super excited and, well, I guess I'm not getting married in December anymore. Ah, my future. Well, that would be in my future folder. It, it's not here. It's, it's, it's all in that folder. I don't, I don't see it. Maybe I am just a normal penguin. My favorite MediaCom guy impression. Oh man, I just wish I had this XLR 300 cable camera. Oh my goodness, I have no idea what you're saying. Well, of course I've heard every MediaCom guy pickup line. I mean, there's, so, you know, if you were a lighting kit, I'd check you out. And of course there's, I'd like to white balance off your teeth. It's gonna go like this, and then it's gonna go like this, and then we're gonna zoom in, and then we're gonna come back out, and then we're gonna have this big explosion. What do you think? Why can't you just express it with words, guys? Seriously.